Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Cure of the Common Game. Today, we're going to open up box number three. Um, box number one was outstanding. Box number two, not so much. So, let's see what the norm is. Because we've had both ends of the spectrum. That number's got to mean something, right? Um, so, we shall see. Here again, we're just going to fly past the commons because uh, we all know that like, they're all good. We have Blasphemous Act, um, Arden, a Bear Claw, and Trove Tracker. Starting all kind of soft. I guess that, like I said, that first box kind of probably set an artificial sense of standard. That's another scroll rack. Never mind. Uh, the first box, this was in the first pack, so we're going to set rares and mythics apart. Uh, Arden, Jury, that is a foil fire diamond. That's pretty. It's a good pack. Let's see what we got. Court of Cunning, Quain, Technically, Queen's Rare, Rebecca, and Soul's Fire. Does anybody know what color eyes Rebecca has? Uh, it matters to me as far as... Um, hold on, I, I, I will... I can't tell what color eyes she's got. But it matters to me for the deck that I build. I know it comes down to something that <laughs> obscure, but, you know, it's me. I'm always looking for a, a different way to build. There's an underground or undergrowth stadium. Uh, Elzor, Breaches. That's a full rare. The Armored Sky Hunter. Uh, we'll put the full rare there. And then, of course, rock, rock. I love the fact that we have a rock and it's an equipment. <laughs> Arcane Signet, beautiful. Uh, Court of Bounty, Jury, Malcolm, and a blue foil diamond. And a piper. I don't know, is the foil piper like uh, the, is that super rare or is that super common as well? Seraphic Greatsword is mythic. I didn't realize that was mythic. Jared Carthalian. Ketis, Cast Down, Spirit. I like how they've gone back and made us legends uh, of all of the, well not all, but a bunch of the... Uh, characters, the name characters that we didn't have. There's a body of knowledge. Hmm. Oh, Tormod, Thorn of the Black Rose Full. That may end up actually being something, right? Uh, I think that's a thing in other formats. We have a, 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 like Open the Armory Thought Vessel War Room. Um, not bad. Gold Muldrak. Amphibians. That was a three rare pack, folks. Uh, Gore Muldrak and Obeka with a foil omen speaker. The Salamander Warrior token is kind of... Did you notice that we got Gold Muldrak and the Salamander Warrior in the same pack? They have the ability to lock cards together now, so that's cool. Uh, we got Magus of the Order. Zara, Siani, Explosion of Riches. This is a... The only monster hit was that, what, Scroll Rack? But those are the only one. I, I mean, some of these others may be something that I'm totally unaware of. But Phyrexian Triniform is a mythic. Dargo, Numa. Oh, love. Yes, I know. I'm a sucker for foils and foil elves and foil anything. 
I know. <laughs> uh, return to dust. Milestone. Imperious Perfect. Oh, God. Such a great card. Uh, training Center. Arumi Sakashima. Mythic. Foil Flesh Bag. It's a bit of not bad. Sakashima makes what? Our fourth? Fourth Mythic. There is a Horizon Stone. I guess I probably shouldn't be doing this like it's my graveyard. Uh, <laughs> Halana, Fathis, a foil Rex Sage. Another elf, I know. It seems like there's enough elf support in this one set to actually build a fairly decent elf deck. Um, that's Zat's Will. Crack the Thumbless. Prava. Eureka the Tiger Shadow. Full etched. Let's go ahead and I it seems like I knew that they had full etched some of the older cards, but I hadn't seen one yet, so I've been sorting these after each box bust. I've uh, been sorting these into the binder. Uh, except for, a, of course, one of each legend. It's a Flame Ken Herald, a Rayoff, Keskit, and a full Fiery Cannonade. Uh, didn't get the second. I, I don't have the second box all the way in the binder yet. Um, Ember Wild Captain. Kaleth, Abomination of Lanawar. Second full rare, also white. Uh, austere command two full rares eh. and we still got you know a few to go let's see whole breacher rogak slurp bitter revelation revelation sorry tired cowboy Three visits, that's a uh, price of a rare. <laughs> uh, Nightshade Harvester, Colfinor, Rebecca again, and the Portent of Betrayal foil. The scroll rack gonna be our, our only big hit. Well, besides, I don't know if if Eureka is considered a big hit. Uh, sweet glum sweet gum recluse, that's not exactly uh Writing home about Rogar Galandra. What? I know, I know the regulars are worth 50 cents, so that puts the full at probably what a buck or two. I don't care. I don't, I've never owned a full command tower before. I like shinies, I love foils, we all know that. But I also uh, build so many decks that I can't bling any of them out because it, it it would just be not really cost efficient because for the price of me buying foals for one deck or or for that matter shocks or fetches or whatever I could build so many more decks so that's why I, I just play with the foals I get. Uh, That's a Rings of Bright Hearth. That's rare and not. I think this is um, ten bucks ish, probably. Still a good rare. Nostro Malcolm, Elvish Doomsayer, another Piper. Uh, Malcolm, because you know fantasy game. <laughs> Love that Sakashima. I've already got my Sakashima partner picked out. Yeah, I won't spoil it. It's uh, it's super, super me. <laughs> Akroma's Will. I'll take all them I can get. That's an amazing dang card. Emoti, Brindlin. Um, that's the Lisi in a full etch. I think they just look better. 
we're going to try to get a little better of a uh, it's I watched videos uh, of like Gavin showing these and you really can't I mean it's hard to appreciate from just a, a video but they are absolutely probably one of my favorite treatments that they have ever done I'll just be dropping stuff uh, what was that four packs left So about two of those a box. I mean, I got one the first box. I got one edge the first box, two the second one, and two in this one. So is two a box? Is that what y'all are experiencing? There's the Blade Griff prototype. Aromi Ghost of Ramira full Sisay's ring. I've never owned a full one of those either. Has it ever been full before? I love how those the actual rings that they're wearing. I love how they just pop like that. I'll have to put that in uh, um, my uh, ring deck. Yes, I'm building a ring deck. It's blue and green. Okay. We have Immaculate Magistrate. Laisa. Nadir. No, two more. We have ingenuity and general. What that is, I'll read it later. All right, Kamal's wheel, Captain Vargas, M Mira, Mira. I don't know. Court Street Denison, Wizard. Y'all need to teach us how to. Uh, I have to say these words. Look at her armor. That's so cool. Last pack. Don't think there's anything we could possibly pull to, you know. This hadn't been. There's a. There's another mythic. Elena, Captain Vargas, Rummaging Goblin. So, I know I didn't do this for the last two, but we got five mythics. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. Five mythics, 29 rares, two full rares, two etched. So that's that's a whole lot of not bad. It really is. Um, especially for a 20-pack box. Or 24, 20. I don't even know how things happen anymore. Uh, 24 booster packs with 20 randomly inserted game cards. So that's it for this one. And uh, I do appreciate y'all watching. Uh, I'm going to put this stuff up and then probably do the next one, do the last one. So uh, like I said, I appreciate y'all watching. Y'all let me know what you think. And uh, come by tomorrow to watch another one. Y'all have a good one.